piece of college football history as we crown this season's national champion. There's been so much that's gone into getting here, twists and turns, and now it builds to this, the battle for supremacy. And it almost feels like we were destined to get to this point. The top two seeds of the college football playoff have survived. They've been on a collision course all season long. They've come through the challenges and the distractions, and now they'll fight for that beautiful trophy. As we'll see the number two seed in this playoff, the Georgia Bulldogs, taking on a team from the Big Ten, the South Alabama Jaguars. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Chris Fowler, joined as always by Kirk Street. and this is it. Two teams enter, one team leaves here as national champions. Pass. Here comes a jet sweep. Got the first down. Now looking for more. They bring him down, but a big chunk of yardage on the play. A big chunk gain in the first play of the drive sets him up near midfield in first and ten. Easy. Quarterback pulls the ball. It's a keeper. Breaks loose at the forty. Oh, and nothing but green grass ahead. And he muscled out of bounds very close to the goal line. I can't believe the defense kept him out of the end zone. Once this quarterback gets out in the open field, he's basically like a running back. He has that kind of skill set. I thought he was going to take it to the house. After the huge play, they're pounding on the door. It's first and goal at the three. They flip it to him on the jet sweep. Touchdown, Jaguars. Offense setting the tone early. Well, that's a well-oiled machine right there. Everyone on this offense has been a star in their roles. But when they're rolling like this, it results in quick and positive results. First and ten, looking to throw. To screen pass, complete to the running back. And they're finally able to stop him. The great execution on the screen pass fooled the defense there. The offense will set up on first and ten. Well, this is great execution here on this screen play to the running back to pick up big yards in the first down. I think in a process, Chris, they sent a message to the defense. You can rush out the quarterback all you want, but when you do, you better be careful because we're going to throw the screen on you. It's a big gain across the field all the way to the 39-yard line. Man, it is fun to watch this guy get out in the open field. I didn't realize he could run like this. That's a big gain for this offense. On the ready. First down and 10 now. Here we go. Here's the snap, looking to throw. Escapes the pocket. He'll avoid the big hit with the slide. Chris, watch him work through his progressions here. Finds the first and the second option aren't there. By the third option, he's got to pull it down and try to pick up some positive yards, of which he did, and then he slides down to avoid the big hit. Oh, a nice play by the defender. Got a hand in there to break up the pass. So after the incompletion, it's second down. There's the snap, and he's looking to throw. Let's it go. 
Incomplete. Very lucky to avoid an interception there. This was a promising drive, but back-to-back -back incompletions makes it third and ten. Dropping back. They're going to throw for the first down. Looking to scramble now. Hurdles over the defender. They get him down, but that's a good run. Enough to move the six and keep this drive going. Offense coming to the line. They might have a chance for a couple more plays before we reach the end of the quarter. Defense makes the tackle as the final seconds of this first quarter run out. I tell you, to be able to pick up a nice game like that, those offensive linemen have to sustain their blocks. Gave them a chance and a really nice game. And after a promising start, we hope that both these teams will just continue with more of this action. Offense jump. getting set for a second down here to begin the quarter. And the wideout goes in motion. A pop pass on the jet sweep. The Jaguars churn out another first down. Yeah, to me, Chris, with this offense, it's almost an extension of their running game. You put the receiver out in motion, you flip the ball out to him, out to the outside, let him do what he does best, which is use his instincts, and he picks up a first down. And it's incomplete, very near the goal line. Okay, it's a second and goal play for the offense. It's pretty simple as a defensive coordinator. When the quarterback drops back to throw, if we get pressure on him, we got a chance to slow him down and win the football game. If we don't, and he gets to the end zone. Touchdown, South Alabama. Who says he needed explosive plays, Kirk? That was a long. Trying to flex the ground game here. Running back takes the handoff. The defense coordinator this week, all week telling us about gap integrity, not giving this running back any creases at all. Really sound defense on that play. Receiver in motion now. From the shotgun, here's an inside give. They bring him down to the 32 yard line. It's not a huge gain here, but if you add up multiple runs like that throughout the course of a game, by the fourth quarter, to start to see that affect the defense. Quarterback on the move, trying to make something happen. The defense will wrap him up, but he's able to scramble for a first down and keep the drive going. And the Jaguars come to the line to start a fresh set of downs. This quarterback is making his big plays in the most critical moments in this game. Not only does he come up with a first down, but he picks up huge yards. And how did it get done? Gets away from the rush, keeps his poise. Now, how about him directing traffic as he moves downfield to pick up extra blockers? It's a really nice run. A pre-snap motion from the offense. They'll switch it up here, looking to throw. And it's going to be incomplete. Defense had a great chance, but a pick couldn't come up with it. Second down here, time for perhaps just one more play before the two-minute warning. And he'll loft it to the end zone. And it's picked off in the end zone. So we reach the two-minute warnings. This hop. On first and ten here, looking to throw the ball. Fires it on the move. And it's complete downfield. That's a big game before he goes out of bounds. It'll move the sticks more than enough for a first down. One play moves the ball to the 44. It'll be first down. He'll take a deep shot. And the pass is dropped incomplete. Would have had a huge game. Took his eye off the ball. Second down play coming up for this offense. And he's back to throw again after that incompletion on first down. He's got a man down the middle. And that big game moves the ball across midfield all the way to about the 36. Big chunk play. This offense operating at peak efficiency. Quarterback heading right, trying to create on the move. Finds a man downfield. That's a big game to the right. No stopping him. Takes it all the way. Touchdown, Jaguars. Billy escapes, Kurt. Extends the play. That was just a thing of beauty. What a great job of just getting out of the pocket and staying calm. It looked like nothing was there. He scrambled, found the open receiver downfield, just like we've seen so many times from this guy on film.
Here comes a first down pass attempt. Stepping to his right now to avoid the pressure. He's looking to scramble. Breaks loose at the 40. Heads out of bounds after another big gain on the ground. He's been shredding this defense for the scrambles today. And this quarterback can play the game. He can throw, and as we see here, he can run the football. The defense does everything that they need to with the pressure. They look like they're in good position to be able to come up with a nice play on him. But instead, he shows how he can slip out of the back door of this defense and pick up a nice game. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw it. Looking to make a play deep downfield. Trying to go very deep there. Good effort. And now it's third down. Not going to be easy here. Backed up a long way to go for a first down. And he'll drop back here on third down. Quarterback moving out of the pocket, trying to create. Gets loose now and heads downfield. Out of bounds after another big scramble. This guy's legs has been a major weapon for the offense today. And looking to throw now on first down. Let's it go quickly. It's caught downfield. Touchdown, South Alabama. This quarterback on fire today. Well, this guy has a knack for the end zone, doesn't he? That's two touchdowns for this guy today. And I don't know if he's done yet. Quarterback keeps the football. Breaks the tackle. Now he's got room to run. Oh, and he breaks free. It's a foot race. Tackle made way downfield. Enormous gain. I mean, is this guy a threat or what? I've been so impressed by what he can do watching him this week on film. I was excited to see him get a chance to show what he could do, not just throwing, but watching him make plays like this. To first and ten play coming up for the offense. Signs with quick throw. The gain is three yards. Brings up a second down and seven. Boy, wide receiver screen can be hit or miss. Either the receiver finds a nice crease and picks up big yards, or the defense can. And he's going to fling it deep, going for it all here. And he's got it. Touchdown, Jaguars. This is just quarterback wizardry. An amazing game with a national championship on the line tonight. This might be as good of a quarterback performance as I've seen in a national championship in some time. The defense has got to try to do something to get him out of sync by trading the blitz or sit back and change up coverage. Come out throwing here to start the drive. Quarterback leaves the pocket on the move now. Deep ball is caught for a huge game here. They bring him down, but an explosive play by this offense. Big game. This line getting set up. It's a first down play. That's the wide receiver coming in motion now. Big pass. Here comes a jet sweep. And he breaks the tackle on the way to a solid game there. And the jet sweep action puts so much pressure on a defense. You get so locked in on the ball attacking you downhill. There's a shot toward the end zone. And it's caught. Touchdown, South Alabama. Well, this is how you start to get rolling. That's two touchdowns so far. And the more he gets fed, the more often he's going to cash in. second the replay official has signaled that he wants to have another look at this play on the double moves out of the shotgun he'll hand it off solid game moves the ball to the 36 hey listen you don't always have to have big plays to be successful it's a nice solid gain here keeps you on schedule and you get ready for that next play and 
he finds a wide open receiver. They forgot about him downfield. Breaks into the clear right down the middle. End zone ahead. Touchdown, Jaguars. Just ran away from the defense. So the offense flexing Kirk and stretching the lead here now in the second half. Well, you can catch your breath here a little bit if you're this offense. That touchdown can help you out. But now your own defense can help you preserve the lead so you can go back out and continue to build upon that to the finish. Shotgun now. Here's a handoff inside. The game good for just a few yards. The defense swarming to the football. Now I like to run play here, and offensively at this point in the game, you want to remain in that attack mode first while also staying in bounds and working that clock. He'll hand it off. Powers through. He's found some room at the 45. Oh, and he's in the clear now. It's a foot race. And he runs it into the end zone. Touchdown, South Alabama. This all week I wondered if this back might get loose and come up with a big play like this. The defense had their back turned, couldn't really see where he was. By the time they realized it, he just had too much speed and he's able to take it to the end zone. clock here with the running game five yard game so it's second and five yeah i like this call here late in the game like this with the lead nothing too fancy just right up the middle trust that offensive line and this running back and just keep working that clock they flip it to him on the jet sweep breaks into the clear it's a sprint now the 40 past the 20 crosses the 10 touchdown jaguars Stretching the lead, this one is getting ugly. up the first looking for more breaks loose at the 45 breaks clear end zone ahead touchdown south alabama and the beatdown continues you know, coaches love to see a football team that doesn't get caught up in the, the scoreboard they're just out executing and doing what needs to be done that's what we're seeing from this offense yeah they continue to put points on the board and they're pulling away i just love to see the execution and how they're going about their business statement to close out this national championship run. You know, the coach told his guys, go out there and leave no doubt. It's a mission accomplished. Well, sometimes a team wins a national championship and they just got hot at the right time. And there's other times when it's been clearly the best team in college football all year. To me, these guys have been right up there as the top team in college football and it's very fitting that they not only win it, but they win it in grand fashion. Well, that's going to do it for us and wrap up another outstanding season of college football. For Kirk Curb Street, I'm Chris Fowler. This has been a presentation of EA Sports College Football. For the first time ever, national champions and your kings of the college football world, the South Alabama Jaguars. <laughs>